You're not? Are you still dead? <laughs> Which, I just think I just think of Chrono poking you with a stick every once in a while saying, hey, are you still dead? Are you still alive? Now he's biting his neck and poking you with dust. <laughs> It sounds about right. But yeah, we got the Ultramarines back. <laughs> Fable, do you remember the mission that they were sent on? Yes, they were supposed to... Uh, they were sent to go retrieve Magnus the Red. And then the Emperor got so pissed, he literally said, I want them to not have the Geller field as they enter the world. <laughs> yes. Oh my god, they have a picture of the Emperor on the side of their ship. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're back. Oh no. Yes. I did not expect you to be the one to pick up this cargo. Indeed, I thought the Adeptus Custodes never left the Imperial Palace. Well, this is a very special occasion. We need to proceed with speed, so if you move to mind. Oh, yeah. Of course, I'm a I need a sh As the Codex has already staked within its sacred pages, the Ultramarines always deliver. Dear God, the Ultramarines. They've, they've gotten better, so I don't dislike them as much, but still. Oh, yeah. By the way, Fable, do you know what those guys are strapped to the box? I'm going to assume those are blanks. Yes, those are blanks. Yes, because the only way to deal with uh, psychers is literally through blanks or really shooty guns. Yeah, uh, Chrono, just so you didn't know, blanks are people that don't seem to have a soul? It, well, no, hmm. it's, it's different. They do have a soul, however, it's inverted. Yeah. Instead of, like, being forward, it's backward. It doesn't make any sense. It's, it's very it. strange, but basically any time weird magic shit is around, they will cause pain to, like, a wizard or a psyker, basically, to a sorcerer, by just being there. And sometimes oh, they okay. give normal people just active headaches. And apparently, according to the way they describe them, uh, blanks are actually really gross to look at, and they possibly smell. Yeah. Even if they shout, they just smell. It, like, it could be the effect of them having their effect on the warp to other people. Funny enough, uh, Kyphus Kane, the guy we always talk about, the hero of the Imperium, his right-hand man is Gunnar Jurgen Wright, who is a blank. He literally uses him to keep people away from him because he acts as his secretary, so basically if they want to get by him, they have to get through the smell that is Jurgen. <laughs> yeah. Also, what's really funny is there is actually a short story of Jurgen just doing his thing where apparently right above them in in a kitchen, someone was summoning a demon and Jurgen just walked yeah. in as he was doing it and the demon got summoned, but due to his effect of being a blank, the demon was weakened so much that Jurgen just pulled out a gun and shot it and killed it. Hmm. And he literally said while doing this, he's about to kill the her uh, about to kill the heretic. He literally said, "I don't understand why people have so much trouble with these things." <laughs> Hello. <laughs> he's apparently an insane driver. Yeah, never get into a car with him because he will just plow through other things because he sees them as obstacles and getting in the way of where he needs to go. <laughs> Yeah, if there's like a school or a building full of people, that's an obstacle. He doesn't, yeah, it doesn't care. Uh, an obstacle, he needs to get through. But... A governor's palace, a graveyard, he'll drive right through. Yeah. <laughs> Anytime you hear that, it's just the blanks over there talking. Oh, no. I don't even know what <laughs> Funny enough, I've quoted these without you knowing uh, Fable at times. But we're just so picked up anyway. So you little pigs can just go away now. Thank you, honorable custodies. If Terra ever requires our aid again, you know where to find us. I do like their helmets. What is 
players to get on the ball. Wow. Those guys are total assholes. They are like the complete opposite of fabulous. Such disgrace. Yeah, tell me about it. Stupid pricks. I remember the Wait. time I cared about anything. Oh no, I forgot. Anyway, let's get this boss back to terror. <laughs> I feel like that's something you would say, but that's, not just because you're quoting it. That, I, that's something I did say, Fable. <laughs> when I was playing that really depressed character on that uh, Fuga stream, uh, sometimes I voice characters for Fable when we're playing, like, visual novel-esque games where they just, characters don't speak. I was just playing that, and yeah. Fable just goes, oh my god. Because I literally said, oh, I remembered when I cared about anything. Oh no, <laughs> I forgot. Oh no. <laughs> oh my god. If you yeah. start doing that, I'm just gonna start calling you a blank, I swear to god. Who's ace? Our oh, glorious old lord awaits our return feverishly. And if any one of us wants a rightful spot as caretaker, we have to hurry. Yeah, but blanks are usually treated as sh treated terribly because they're seen as mutants. I never expected you to call through such emotion and kindness about oh, yeah. like this. Truly, you are the ideal father figure, loving your sons no matter what happens to them. Of course. Too bad bad it's fucking Hello, El Drago girl. How have you been? We're reacting to this. We're seriously not going to see it. Yeah, we're not going to see, uh. And being nice to people. We're not going to see him talk at what he said nice things about. I'm great. Well, that's good to hear. Passion and love. When every single second sitting on this... But yeah, we're not going to hear what he said, the good things he said about his sons. <laughs> because no one knows what the Omega symbol is in this guy. Like yes, it's full of sparkles and gold in here. Oh god. <laughs> want us to stand guard as the boss I didn't say that one to you, but I yeah. mean something dangerous could be in it. I've already told you that I'm more than capable of looking after myself. Honestly, yeah, he probably is. And trippy presence is not required. Now get the fuck out of here for the last fucking time. Trippy presence <laughs> before you poke someone's eyes out. I don't want to understand what you meant by that. We won't do that last thing. I said, put some damn back later. There they go. Sigh. One of these days, I'll get someone to throw a good match at one of those guys. Let's see how much they appreciate their naked oiled up bodies then. Everything in this box is very angry and very scary. Of course, I know you cuss cunt. Now open the box and then back off. Here we go. Do you know who it is, Fable? Yes, it's Magnus the Red. <laughs> <laughs> they shoved him into a box. What? Wow. The Alpha Marine succeeded in bringing Magnus here after all. That is absolutely fucking hilarious. <laughs> Father. Magnus succeeded. Father. Yeah, it is hilarious that he got captured by the Ultra Marines. My father. Yes, yes. Stop yelling so fucking loudly, you demonic good for nothing book banger. <laughs> Me with powers unimagined by me immortals. Not even you 
will be able to stand against my wrath. Shut the fuck up with your empty bravados, Magnus. I don't know how the fuck the Alpha <laughs> Marines actually yeah. managed to get you all the way from the Eye of Terror, but clearly your supposed psychic prowess only works when you fuck something up. Stop mocking me! Yeah, Magnus the Red did everything wrong, I will be honest. He really did. Yeah. He has a similar problem to the Eldar where he thinks way too highly of himself, and it's something that per it's perpetuated through his Legion. <laughs> Because I think, yeah. I think when all the space wolves were having to have a chat with him, like in the back of their minds, uh, one of the thousand suns, his legion was literally saying, "Oh, he can't possibly comprehend that I'm already thinking like ten steps ahead, which, or think that I can't." Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, it's a, uh, it's you a problem with Magnus. Look down upon me for having my powers. How is that you yourself also had? You never defended me when Russ and the others tormented me for it. But now, my powers have been recognized by my new ruler, and he has boosted them tenfold. When I am in full control, I shall have my vengeance and kill you. You have never been in control of anything True. since you gave yourself up to Zinch. The moment you met him, you lost. Pretty much. You don't even know it, but he's been feeding you dirt ever since he made his first move on you. I'm sure he didn't have any difficulty convincing you to join him, though, considering the way you seem to think about that. Yeah. He made you dance in the pale moonlight, like a puppet, didn't he? That boy ain't any good for you, son. <laughs> I have been the master of my own destiny ever since the day Lord Sage first contacted me! Uh, this will go back to... Yeah, on Prospero. Okay, okay. I gotcha. Hmm? What was that? My dad was telling me something. Oh, okay. Not being allowed to ever make use of the warp. Arkea Council thing was so shitty. The Arnea Castle was a bit shitty, but he didn't help himself in the long run. It's basically where no, Russ like was it. literally using court to basically accuse him of doing bad shit, and quite literally, for all of the bullshit that he, uh, let's just say, when being accused in court by one of your own brothers, that everyone's like, my guy, you're not even giving an actual argument of, against it. All the Emperor asked him to do was to hold off on the warp stuff. Yes, this is it the war. Going around here today, actually. Be father's right after all. Perhaps I should just stop. Hello. Ugh. Oh my boy. It hurts just to look at. What are you supposed to be? Eh. No one too important. I might not have any form of significance whatsoever in everyone's life. That or I may actually be the smartest being in the galaxy. None of what you said made any sense or helped me in any way figure out what the fuck you are supposed to be. Seriously, what's with all those tentacles? For now, it does not matter who I am. Maybe it does matter. Chances are that I have some information that may or may not interest you about the future. And... what is it? Something absolutely horrible about your beloved brother, Horus. Horus? What is it you know? Tell me. Uh... Actually, they didn't point this out, but when the first time uh, Magnus met Zeech, he did a stupid by thinking that he could defeat him when uh, Zeech let him win because he knew Magnus would just become more arrogant. So, it's really congratulations, you played yourself. Yep. And also, uh, Magnus is missing one eye because of the fact that he... Uh... Oh, yeah. Because the fact that his uh, sons actually had a curse on them, I think Zinch did it. Yeah, it was the... Um, yeah. Yeah, I, I like, say a little bit about it, but yeah, he gave up all of his eyes to Zeech so that the warp spasm problem would stop, which basically what happens is some of his sons would just, like, break into becoming warp uh, or chaos spawns, which is basically... You're forcibly, like, ripped apart and reattached, if I remember correctly, into a weird, warpy creature with, like, crab arms and tentacles and, yeah. 
Yeah, it wasn't great. And then he comes back later, even after he gave his eye to Zeech to stop it. Can't refuse! Sure, I can really trust that. I mean... Can't you tell how trustworthy I am by my looks? Oh my god. Nope, not at all. Besides, I think my father would... Ooh, daddy's boy is too good for me and my office. Stop it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's going to refuse my offer, he can't refuse! Silence! <laughs> Maybe it's because he enjoys being the bottom bitch! And because he doesn't have the balls to take his price <laughs> <laughs> place at the top! No, I don't have to take their shit or your shit. Fuck it, fuck you, I am in! He is so easily manipulated because of his own ego. Vengeance is your best shot, son. You'll never be able to destroy me as much as you already have. If it were not for your immature use of your powers, I would not yeah. be sitting here on this throne all skeptical and shit. Uh, no, it's not my fault that me and my psychic powers managed to ruin your feeble project when I tried to save you. Lord Z. Oh, just, yeah. Um, he got manipulated hmm. again. This is actually what happened. He tried to contact his father through the warp and uh, fucked up pretty hard. You remember when I told you that he was working on a webway thing? So that, you know, he could travel. To me, he could travel more easily throughout, you know, the galaxy. Talking about me? Yeah. Who else am I talking to? Uh, I thought you were talking to, uh, Fable. Uh,. I think so. Well, will be lost if I can you're gonna see what happened when he tried to like not listen. Everyone. If there wasn't a uh, fucking wall in the way! Yeah. <laughs> do do tomato man! You okay? Tomato man. Get out of here. I don't need any more of your help. Looks to me like you do, Sunny. You can't help me. This wall is built up by some incredible psychic powers for a purpose, and I am not going to break it down. Father put it here for a reason, and I won't transgress any further. Not going to, or not able. Don't stop oh my god. Face. I won't fall for it. Even if I destroy this wall, it might have terrible, terrible consequences. I mean, I don't even know what purpose it has. Ooh, the psychops boy is being reasonable. He doesn't want to mess with what he doesn't understand because he enjoys living in ignorance. Not wanting to break his real little psyche. Seriously? You're really doing this again. <laughs> you come along here to warn your father, but as soon as a small obstacle comes in your way, you give up immediately. Shut up! Oh my god. I tried getting through it without breaking it. I'm not strong enough. It's built up by a psychic might that surpasses my own. <laughs> he's not strong oh, here enough we because go. he's a freaking pussy yeah. that shits himself upon seeing me out. <laughs> fucking hell, Zeech. Terrifying inanimate objects. Maybe we should get someone ballsy enough like Lee Nebras to do it instead. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, yeah, Lehman has a thing. He has a thing with the lion and with uh, Magnus over here. Because, uh, yeah. No, I am better scrub. than that ignorant savage. Also, I don't have time for this shit. Time is of the essence, and I have to get through. Emotional damage. Come in. You know not to do that when we're doing reactions. First warning. To do what? He just played a sound alert that's really loud. Oh shit. We gonna give it a few seconds. That. that that sound alert is naturally loud, and you know it. I'm sorry to everyone over on YouTube that's gonna see us and have to deal with it. Then just don't press it at all. But yeah. I did it! I am the mightiest psyker in the galaxy! I am the strongest! Suck it, Lehman, you furry fuck! <laughs> Suddenly <laughs> demon. <laughs>
yeah, that's basically what happened. Is he broke through the wall that his brother had built, and immediately just a swarm of demons came through into the palace. Damn. And that's what broke the golden throne and why he had to sit on it and couldn't go off and, you know, deal with Horus. So, yeah, everything's Magnus's fault. If you had and broken through that wall I had set up, ruined my masterful webwave project, and led a button of demons into the Imperial Palace, I would be healthy, happy, and able to scratch my fucking nose right now. <laughs> In addition, did you really think me saying not to use your powers was bullying you? I was trying to protect you, and prepare you for something greater. Dumbass. Dumb yeah, I'd end it with dumbass. You had told us of the powers of chaos before we were enlightened. Maybe we wouldn't have turned against you like this. This is still all your fault, you damnable lich. The risk in informing you about the powers of chaos. This is the one thing that everyone's always talking about that I'm not really sure if he was right or wrong to do this because chaos is very bad. And sometimes even when you know about it, it's still really bad. Yeah. But yeah. too great. Especially to someone like you, who always took such massive fucking interest in the cult shit like that. That's it does. For the curse day when you found me on Prospero, I was living my life with scholars who accepted the use of the war. They were kind and open to knowledge, something you have never been. That's probably just another reason why you had Lehman Russ's pack come to Prospero to burn it. I never told the man Russ to burn Prospero, you fucking crybaby. Yeah, this is actually true. He never told him to burn Prospero. He told Lehman to go get Magnus and bring it back. But Horus came by and said, No, Father had changed his mind. He wants you to kill Magnus. And Lehman went, All right. Mm. Anything to say, Fable? Uh, if I remember right, Lehman actually did a backbreaker on Magnus when he was trying yes. to kill him. Yes, he did. Which is kind of cool when you think about it. I kind of want to get art of that. Like, with you know the old Batman thing with Bane? Like, the cover? Yeah. He, I want to do yeah, that he with literally Lehman. broke his back. <laughs> so cool. You should get art of that. That'd yes, be really cool did. to see. Why yeah. Really I had Lehman Russ sent there to arrest him and bring you to me. Yeah, so pretty I much. Bang the shit out of you and don't give me a shit out of yourself. No! You lie! You're lying! The reason why Lee Man Russ attacked me was because fucking Horos told him that I had changed my mind and wanted you dead. Fucking Horus, the one you joined during the yeah. game, was the one who orchestrated all this. So what was that about controlling your own fate, huh? Shut your fucking face, you cheese doodle. <laughs> cheese doodle. No. <laughs> yeah. Can't be true. You, you must be lying. You were and are very important to me and my future. He did say he would. He did say he would heal all wounds and repair the Imperium. It just wasn't your time yet, back then. Also, I may not ever have shown you the proper fatherly love you desire, mm -hmm. but I love you nonetheless. And now, I have brought you here to give you what I have been intending to give you for so long. A second chance. That is pretty sweet, though. Oh, oh yeah. I mean, here's the thing. In Modern 4K, he did tell Mortarian, of all people, he's that he could be redeemed. So, I mean, this is kind of possible. 